And just a quick how-to on proxying yourself on school or whatnot so you can get past all the crap that they filter out in firewalls. So first thing we're going to do is open up our putty which is on a flash drive. Now oh, we're going to go down to SSH tunnels. Dynamic port, I use 999. Okay, that's set for you. Go back up top. The session is going to be my session. And set it up as it's called school. Save it and open that. Log in as net password. Alright, now that is your proxy. What we do now is set ourselves proxy on this, because right now we are sitting at this IP address, which is my local address. And if you're using Firefox, Tools, Options, Advanced Network, and then Settings, Manual Configuration, Local Host for SOX5, and the same port you did earlier. That. And now, as you can see, we have a new IP address. And Explorer is a tad bit different. You want to type in inetcpl.cpl, .cpl. gets you to our program. There we go. Use a proxy server, advanced. Uh, you see this 127.0.1 to show that both localhost and 001 work. Same port. There we go. There we go. All right. Now we can refresh this. There we go. And Google Chrome uses the exact same settings. So we'll go ahead and refresh this one as well. There we are. Everything's set. And to undo what we did there, just go back to Firefox and get rid of the proxy. And it's CPL again. There we go. That's Chrome and an Explorer again. And you're all set. That's it. You may finish, just close out. Now we're done. Enjoy.